What's up, y'all? It's Nelson here. I'm gonna show y'all that incline dumbbell chest press. Go ahead and take a look at this bench right here. I have it up to about 20 degrees of an incline. That's pretty much all I need. I don't want it too high, so if we're going around 45 degrees, that's way too high. Once you got it set up, easiest way to get those dumbbells in position is while you're standing, put that on the thigh, put that on the thigh, go ahead and take a seat, make yourself nice and comfortable. And now you use those thighs again to help them hands on the way up. As you can see, my hands are tilted slightly towards the center. I'm not facing the plate towards the front. Elbows slightly tucked in and press. You don't need to touch all the way to the top. If you like to, go ahead and go for it, but you don't need to, but you do want to get that full range of motion. All right, nice control on that way down. Four seconds, elbows tucked in and press, right? You don't want those to go too low and have those dumbbells touch the chest. You want to stop around one to two inches right above that chest and press. Down one, two, four seconds on that way down and boom and press. As you're going down, if you have trouble keeping those elbows, get them tucked in, initiate that way down by tilting those dumbbells slightly towards each other. That way you're pressing um, without any shoulder um, strain, right? What you want to do is slowly initiate the way down, rotate those dumbbells a little bit towards the center, and that way you can keep those elbows tucked in through the entire movement. Boom. Once you're done, drop to that chest, boom to those thighs, to the ground, and that's it.